Oj, bor du stöks? Oh, there's a chance here. First wheel sort of chance of the game to Weil. That was that's an early goal for Canoe. Oh, it's the first goal of the game, the Canoe. Going for a corner there, but no. All right. Oh. Corner to White Hill Welfare, the first corner of the game. Oh, I should have left it, I think. Oh. Thank you, Liz. 
Oh, shot, no, no, target. Oh, oh, he's got away. Oh, oh, it's a good goal. They just never got the ball away, and it's right just before half time as well. A good time for Canil to score. Uh, it's half time, 2 0. I mean, Canil just scored there, uh, oh, just um, the last minute there, and 2 uh, 0. Just speaking to the welfare guys, none of them want to be in camera. <laughs> uh, I, I think you'd be swearing too much if it did. Because really, they've, they've, okay, somebody's gifted Canil these two goals, they've just not cleared the lines of mistakes. Um, it's, it was quite an even game, uh, but that second goal, right before half time, was a colour, really, for them. But I've seen Whitehall. Well, if you're fighting back, and you never know. As I always say, a game of two halves. Half time, two and all that. I mean, that was a colour goal at the, the end there, uh, the first half, because um, I thought the game was pretty even, you know? Yeah, it came at the right time. I think Kyle, you know, he's, he's been doing that all season, but um, yeah, we needed it, and this time of the season, getting that advantage at half time was important. Yeah, because you're wanting to. Uh, <coughs> confirm that promotion place and you'll be looking at other results as well Aye, so yeah. you've got to win the day that will uh, well help eh? you've got a game in hand I think as well am I right? yeah a game in hand but um, yeah like I say it's just we're finishing up next Saturday and hopefully we're, we're in the the promotion obviously the extra place now with the way the leaks and instructions went so um, yeah we need to we need to get up now I think you know at the start of the season maybe you know, in the distance, but at the moment it's, it's, looking, it's looking well on. It's when we played them there last season, um, but uh, or earlier on the season, but good setup and things. Um, with regards to their manager, I know he was a dress manager um, last season, yeah, so yeah. Um, they'll be well organised and they, they look okay tonight. But I think we've we deserve to win that, I think. Yeah, okay, thank you very much. Okay. I've met a fellow uh, ground up on George, uh, you're a fifer, you were telling me. Um, is this your first visit to Canoole as well? Ah, it is, yeah. Yeah, no, it's a tidy wee ground. Yeah, good. Like and it. what grounds have you got planned? Any games you, you're looking forward to? Uh, I don't know. I might try and get to a game next week, but I'm running out of fixtures now and I can't always get on a Saturday at this time. Yeah. Do you think, think there'll be a wee fight back from Lyle Welfare then? Well, I thought they yeah. were on top first half, to be honest. Yeah, I mean, they're, they're running out of the, the game. They're just... Uh, yeah. It was just bad, uh, well, they couldn't clear the ball. Oh, exactly. And that second goal, Canel was the right colour, eh? Yeah. Right before half time, yeah, you know? Definitely. Hey, George, it was nice meeting you. Yeah, and and uh, your dog, of course. Oh, this is Billy. <laughs> yeah, good stuff, right? See you later, cheers. Right, that's the teams out for half time, just waiting on the big goal. There's a kick off, second half. And I'll just make my way around to the. where I was before. There's a chance for the ball here. Oh, oh. Oh, 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 that was close. <laughs> if we just corrected right by that, that would have been in. Oh, long range effort. But certainly why all the welfare have come out here uh, really firing all guns blazing. Because um, if they got to go back then they're still in the game, but they need to got to go there we go the Oh another, another corner that'll be the second corner of the, the half uh, to Canal. Again, just no good getting the lines cleared. Oh, a crucial third goal of the game. I mean, if White or Welford had got that, then it would be more of a game. But I'm, I'm not saying it kills off the game, but that's a, 
hard task now for a while to get back into this game. Did you get a goal shot, right? Four nil now. Oh, corner to Whitehall. A long throw in. I'll have to find the man, no? Oh, here's a target defence. Free kick outside the box, I wonder if I have a direct shot here. Oh. Oh, well, we a wee attack here. So the box, it must be. Yeah. For a chance for play all real fair. Oh, oh, the goalie! That was a when these skaters are along the the, the ground, and it, the goalie had difficulty there. Oh, there we go. A goal for Whitehall. Well done. There we go, Joe. Oh, that was not far away. Oh, a little bit top. That's it, full time. 4 1 to Canal. Okay, a big thank you to the officials and volunteers at Canal. I was uh, spending a lot of time talking to them off camera. Uh, they didn't want to appear on camera. 
for camera shy, but uh, really interesting conversations and discussions because I, I didn't know an awful lot about Canoel, so I'm now informed about uh, the football club. And uh, it was great speaking to the two ladies in the refreshment, but again, they were very friendly and very informative. Thanks to uh, Paul Anderson, the injured player. I hope he, he recovers and he's playing again soon. A nice guy. And it was great meeting George, the, the ground topper who lives in Fife. Uh, that was his first visit to Tullock Park. And uh, I hope to see George again. A lovely dog as well he had. As to the game, I mean, I've, that's three times I've covered, covered quite a little welfare. I speak about the guy, the guys all the time. And I speak about all of them, the other games as well. Uh, but, I mean, <laughs> no wonder they wouldn't want to speak to me. They were disappointed. Why all we have played some good football? Uh, and, because one of these games is difficult. Who was more clinical in front of goal? Well, obviously, um, Canoel, <laughs> who were. And he scored a couple of cracking goals as well. Um, quite a welfare. Uh, I, should have been beaten 4-1? Probably not. Probably 4-1 flat uh, uh, Canoel. But, you know, having said that, it's all about scoring goals. There was five goals in the game, so as a neutral, it was a good game and I enjoyed it. So well done to everybody involved. And I quite like the setup there at, at Tullock Park. Uh, and what I like about these sort of grounds, uh, uh, there's room for improvement. Uh, and hopefully they can maybe make uh, these improvements because uh, I, I like a, a bit of banking or something, a wee, a wee bit height. Uh, because I think a couple of the goals, it was difficult to tell the angles. There was two goals they scored at acute angles. And